Jazz for sixteen hundred. Oh. Answer. There you go. <laughs> I will wager 3,800. Okay, here is the clue. Born in New Orleans, Louis Armstrong performed songs named for these two local so I've been bee the, Everyone's body language during these things is so great. <laughs> I've been to New Orleans a bunch of times and I, I couldn't come up with the other bee, like the bourbon was obvious and I knew Beale was wrong. What are bourbon? I still don't remember it now. And this happened three months ago. <laughs> I thought you'd say uh, it. Believe me, oh, I would. Right. It's Basin. 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 Yeah, I'm, Basin Street. I'm mad enough to admit I had. No, I would have said bourbon and beer as well. My wife takes me to, or my wife, <laughs> let, me, let me restart that. My wife makes me take her to New Orleans every year, so uh, that would have been nice if I had picked that one up. Uh, you can see like how uh, delighted we all are every time Brad gets a Daily Double, not because uh, it's good for us, but just because we can't believe his phenomenal luck. How does he keep finding these? Well, well, this is your secret. Yeah, this is just better for me if I didn't get any. <laughs> <laughs> is that your new strategy? Daily double unhunting? Avoid the daily doubles. So watch out I've next. Done, I've crunched a lot of numbers to find out which uh, squares on the board are least likely to have the daily doubles. Yeah. And I'm going to go there. That was a tough one. I feel like a, a good chunk of, I mean, Brad just had terrible daily double luck during this tournament. And I feel like over half of the daily doubles that, uh, that he missed, I did not know either. And so I'm thinking to myself, I could very easily have found that one. Brad taking one for the team. I do my best. 